Hey y'all, it's Joe, just Joe, and I'm back today with the BoxyCharm pop-up unboxing. Now, I did order three boxes from Boxy Pop-Up, but I got an email today that there was a error in um, their stock, that I would not be receiving my third box, which had some of my favorite items in it, like the Natasha Denona palette, the Cranberry, and another one, and... Well, anyways, I'm not going to be getting that box. I guess anything in that box from what the email said. So we'll go over the two boxes that I do have and see what I decided what was worth it in Boxy Pop-Up. So the first box here is a smaller size. Of course, it's got some cat hair on it. And let's see what is in this box. This is the first box I got that I guess I thought was the most important before Pop-Up lured me back in. And, sorry about the noise. Here is a peek at the inside. And first off, I got a duplicate of the Saturday Skin Vitamin C Sleep Mask. And when Pop-Up started, I didn't, I had not gotten my box of charm actually i haven't gotten my box of charm premium yet it got lost somewhere in nashville and they are resending it <sighs> long story but so i didn't know if i would get this or not but i did get it in my um base box so but i'm glad to have two of them i love sleep mask and then i got i'm gonna pull these out of the box as you can see this box is empty I did get the Kate Somerville Exfoliate Cleanser. My husband's been having um, so a little bit of a tough time with cleansers that he feels like it's working on his skin. He has extremely oily skin. So I was going to see if using this every so often would help with his clean skin. And I also got the Kate Somerville Exfoliate Daily Fo Foaming Cleanser for him to use. On the days he's not using the exfoli exfoliating. Oh, I think I said that wrong. Backwards. This is the acne. This is the one he'll probably use every other day. And this is the one he'll use more often. Anyway, he'll use one of them one day. And he'll use another another day. <laughs> and that's all I got in that then you know how it is pop-up goes on and then you start thinking about items that you didn't have and they're so cheap so i got a bigger box and i'll let you peek inside this one Oop, rid of that well if we can get in here i'll let you take a peek and here at the peak. And let's see what we got in here. Oh, I've forgotten because I hadn't opened this in a while. I did get, I've been wanting these so bad. And my my friend Aura from Young Girl Aura on YouTube I told me that I really need to try the Glamnetic. So I got the Bella and the Baby Girl Lashes. And the magnetic liner. Here is Bella. I really like the way. I hope these fit under my glasses. They only had a couple to choose from. But these glasses. There's a lot more space right in here. Other than my old glasses. So I think it'll work. But I haven't tried them yet obviously. I actually forgotten what's in the box. Let's see. And then I got a lip oil from I Do Care. And let's open her up. And she looks like this. I love lip oils, lip mask, all the things that make your lips soft. I'm really bad. It, my lips always, to me, feel dry. I'm, and I mean, I put that stuff on constantly. Sometimes I feel like it's some kind of conspiracy. The more you put on, the more you need it. The more it's almost like an addiction. And then we got the Glow Recipe, the Papaya Silver Cleansing Balm. Love Cleansing Balm. The one I have right now is about halfway finished. So I went ahead and got me another one. 
I like the cleansing balms and the cleansing gels. I think the last pop-up, I got the Rian, yeah, the Rian cleansing gel, because I like the gels and balms to get the makeup off, and then a regular cleanser to double cleanse afterwards. And then, pull these out, and you see the box is empty. I got the Hank and Henry. This is the mauve palette. She looks like this. That's really pretty. I like, I love owls, period. But of course, um, this is cruelty free and vegan, which I love. And then here, look how pretty those colors are. Y'all know I love my pinks and purples and mauves. And this one, I feel like I get the best of both worlds. There's enough to do a neutral look, a pink look, a more darken it up with the gray. So I'm excited about having this. And then I didn't have the Hank and Henry Berry palette either. I didn't get it last time. So this is what she looks like. And again, I love the packaging on these. And there's the back. Again, vegan and cruelty free. Here's what she looks like in the back. And then this one is everything to me. Oh, I could take this palette just about anywhere and live off these colors. These, if, if I just throw a green palette with this, I'll be set for a month. I love these colors. So I'm really happy with everything that I got. A little recap. So I wish I had the prices, but they don't send little slips. So I got the Bella and Baby Girl lashes. I got the liner. I got the I Do Care lip oil. At the bottom, I'm going to say sleep mask, which I'm, I haven't used my the one that I got yet, but I'm really excited. I'm working on um, another one I got in Boxy Pop-Up, and I cannot think of the name. It's so thick that I'll be glad to go to a thinner one. But I will say, my skin feels amazing in the morning. And then the papaya glow. I love glow recipe, period, but the cleansing balm I'm excited to have because I like the balms and gels, like I said. The two cleansers that I hope will work for my husband. If not, I'll use them. I mean, they, it'll be fine for me to use, but I'm hoping they work for him since he's been having a little bit of difficulty with finding a cleanser he likes. And then, of course, the Hank and Henry Berries palette and the Hank and Henry Mall palette. So, I'm really excited. I know it doesn't seem like much to a lot of people, but it's all I needed. Well, I didn't need any of it, but, you know... They have hundreds of stuff on that pop-up, and it's hard to figure out. You get, I don't know, kind of mesmerized, and the little sparkles happen, and you see all these pretty colors, and you want everything. So I really, really tried hard to get the things that I n technically kind of needed, like the cleansers and stuff, and then just get a few fun things, which would be the lashes and the palettes. So... I didn't spend hardly anything on all this either. I wish they gave us receipts for totals. But anyways, that's my little boxy pop-up haul. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you're staying safe. I hope that you're having a great day. I hope you're making good decisions. And I hope to see you next time. If you like this type of video, please like, comment, and subscribe, and ring the bell. So you'll be notified of my future videos. Bye, guys.